so good morning friends hope you're doing fine so we have released a new update a new tool which is called iv so basically this is all about data trading and how you can encash data with uh, price action so once you log into the stock mojo you can see a tab where we have mentioned iv tools are now live click on this try now So you can see a chart. In this, you can have four tabs, which is called Wall Skew, IVHP, IVP, IVHV, and IV Grid. So let's talk an interesting feature, which is called uh, IV Grid. Once you click on IV Grid, if you are looking for any bullish undertone asset, like from the a galaxy of fno you need to come down and select hv mine hv is greater than iv matlab historical volatility is greater than implied volatility so basically what does it do it it whenever whenever an options or a futures which works on data whenever hv historical volatility is moving above implied volatility there will be long wall there will be long wall matlab you can long the volatility you can use bullish undertone you can bullish you can use bullish strategies to encash this long volatility now couple of things that we need to ensure uh, or we can say we can combine is the build up is the op option chain whether we see the call writers are trapped or the put writers are advancing near atm that will double ensure that we are on the right track so let me show you something uh, which can give you a fair idea on how it's used when you click on hv is greater than iv you can see all this sorted like this so you will see power india the power india is 22.16 percentage on a negative side that means the historical volatility is way above the implied volatility now if you click on this tab you can see the movement the movement hv crosses or iv crashes Here the IV has crashed. See, the moment positive IV minus HV comes into a negative state, just look at the price. It was twenty thousand four hundred fifty rupees in a futures, and once it crashed, you can see the price moving up twenty thousand nine hundred, twenty one thousand three hundred, twenty one thousand seven hundred, twenty two thousand, twenty one four hundred, twenty one five hundred, and currently it closed yesterday as twenty two thousand four hundred ten. so once we see around 2000 points jump in futures or if you have taken an option obviously always use hedge uh, while taking options or you can use a, a ratio spread or a debit spread to encash long wall once you do that you can see there is a great move or in most of the cases we can see there is a long build up or a short covering move now if you want to check power india you can go to the futures lab or you can go to the open interest and see where the unwinding is happening see if you if you just click on uh, the option chain it will open power india the same tab that you are looking in and you can see where the players are moving their money in okay secondly this is the oi change now you can see this is in incremental okay you can see the put oi is increasing matlab put writers are advancing now the call writers are sitting over here now with 23000 so it will it will act as a resistance now you can also see the build up go to the future sentiment cycle and have power india you can see the build up is happening 
there is no shots only one day shot you need to understand build up when there is a one day shot you need to really check are uh, the call writer strapped or is just a profit booking from big players if you can read this data you can read this data you will be unstoppable this is a one month data that we cater in so you can also double confirm the same let's go to the options lab iv grid just go to hp above iv those who are looking for uh, bullish position so we can see idea ltf policy bazaar now i would be very keen to check those numbers which are just on the verge of being more negative like this like this britannia it's on the verge of being negative so there is slight build up over here i will track it for next couple of days how the build up is seen again i will go and check uh, the futures chart or a price action chart wherein we can see major build up happening and then once it comes into negative look at this this is previous this is august the moment it turns from positive i iv minus hv comes to negative look at the future price over here it was 5500 the moment it came negative it went to 6300 it requires patience it requires tracking it requires an in-depth study of how hp goes into the long wall zone or the iv turns negative as hp comes greater than iv so this is a very short tool and a tool which is not talked uh, by many of the pro traders or traders because it requires uh, consistency and using the tool for the next couple of months or 3 months or 4 months you can you can imbibe um, this in your trading journal so use this tool uh, look at this this is a positive wall bank x rvnl tell me about it. here and you can very well see the price is coming down why because iv is increasing now suppose if the iv increases you will have juicy premiums if you have juicy premiums the call writer will come and in cash this premium as we are nearing towards the month end the month end expiry so as you know that anything which which nears the month end expiry all your etms which are uh at the money if they are not standing towards the spot will go to zero so that's an encashing level that we need to understand so this is how uh, iv and hp comes into play so we will be more uh, posting more videos on uh, uh, how historical volatility plays uh, key role in predicting the vol grid so stay tuned and uh, do keep your uh, curious coming in the group thank you